I like whipped cream. And, uh, This recipe was really too easy. Was should, it too easy? This was too easy, yeah. It's not easy for you. We, <laughs> You know, we're out of time. We're out of time. Yeah. Well, well, we're just going to have to cut something out of the middle. <laughs> <laughs> On this show, that's not going to be hard to do. <laughs> of at home on the range and we, we gotta put this in there it's gonna take forever for this to melt what is this what's the matter with the pot oh i have a new thing okay this is a cooking tip you know how you never know when your your water's boiling look at this you always know when the water's boiling Barbara. no you really don't that's look. the dumbest thing i ever saw no it's not a dumb thing it is dumb there is this piece of glass Isn't it right wonderful? and you put it you put it in your water before you start boiling and then, when it boils, it rattles. Isn't that wonderful? <laughs> so you'll Barbara, never need... We've got to get this in the double boiler so it melts. Now, the only thing is you must be Barbara, very... We're, yes. we're making chocolate mousse, and these people don't want to be here all night. Chocolate mousse? Yes. Now, don't touch that. That's really hot. I'm not the one that touches hot stuff. Okay. How uh, much chocolate's in there? There's eight ounces of semi-sweet chocolate. Eight ounces of semi-sweet chocolate. Yeah, yeah. No, it, it, it's got to do its thing. Now, put the lid on it, see? Oh. Now you can carry on with your other nonsense, whatever okay. that is, okay? Well, that's called a hot alert. Don't throw that away! Oh, right. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Anyway, and then I found this little cute thing in the store, and it said, if I could, I'd cook if I could find the can opener. Okay. And Isn't I thought that, nice? that was really cute. Put, and it, we we put it on the refrigerator. That's nice. Put that on the refrigerator here. Yeah. You know, people usually put those on the front of the refrigerator. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, what are we making? We're today? making chocolate mousse. Chocolate mousse? Chocolate mousse, yes. Well, you're not really big on desserts. Well, yeah. Yeah, I'm big on desserts. I like desserts. Well, no, I'm not saying you like them. I mean, the desserts we've made have not been wonderful. That's they have. Saying. We made lemon meringue pie. <laughs> lemon meringue pie. Now, it's going to be a long time. We've got to figure something to do while we're waiting for that to melt. Well, do we add anything to it? Because you had your it? little glass thing you're playing with. I thought that was a great tip. So we just let this We sit can't here. do anything till that melts. We're stuck. <laughs> okay. Well, what else are we going to... So you're going to have to fake it. I wanted to put it in before and you had to play with your little glass thing. Always my fault. All right. Well, tell us about the rest of the recipe. Well, when, that, we when, those, when that chocolate melts, we're going to put in two tablespoons of coffee. Regular coffee? Real strong coffee. Decaf? Yes, naturally. Okay. Real strong decaf. And then we're going to put in two egg yolks. And then we're going to put in some powdered sugar. Uh huh. And then we're going to whip all this. This is real heavy whipping cream. We're going to whip that up in the KitchenAid mixture, uh -huh. which we're not going to mention the name of because they're not sponsoring us. That's right. Uh, and then we're going to put the whole mess together. And then we're going to put it in little things and put it in the refrigerator. Uh, <laughs> Now we're going to put some whipped cream on it. Oh, my and a cherry, favorite. And a cherry on the top. There are so many things you can do with whipped cream. I Barbara, love it. Barbara, stop. <laughs> oh. No, no, no. We have not used whipped cream in no. a long but time you know, on this show. But you know, I've got a, I've got a trick I'm going to show you with whipped cream that you haven't seen, which is rare. Uh, because, Pay attention, because, Stanley. Because you usually, you usually get whipped cream in this little thing that you squirt that's got an aerated yes. can in it. 
No, nobody asked you to open a refrigerator, Barbara. Come back here. Uh, the squirt and it, it pollutes the atmosphere. It makes oh, holes. Really? In, it makes holes in the sky or something. Oh no. And uh, well, they say it does. I don't believe it does. So they have uh, some other stuff called Cool Whip. But it's not as much fun. Well, I'll show you. I can, we can make it fun. That's the trick. But I'm not going to show you that till we get to the, till the chocolate. It's not as now. erotic either if Nothing. you go to bed with a tub of Cool Whip. <laughs> <laughs> At least. Oh, Barbara. At least we have Barbara. Ready with. This is stuff you put on the top of the. Moose. Oh, okay. Never mind. Jeez. Well, now, okay, okay. So while we're waiting for that, you to know, do it, it may have even melted. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see if it's melted. Oh, it's getting there. It's getting there. It's getting there. Put the lid back on now. Okay. So while we're waiting for this to melt, why don't we do? Is that hot? It's I'm not going to fall hot. for that trick anymore. A little bit hot. No, why don't we do one. what? Let's do why something. Why don't we put something in the KitchenAid mixer Good and idea. get all that prepared? All right. And it'll it'll and then it'll be all saggy when we get ready to use it. But yeah. that's all right. That's all right. Mmm. That's good. Now I got it all over my face though. Now, this Boy, is this heavy whipping cream. Heavy whipping cream. Heavy whipping cream, yeah. I guess it wouldn't have occurred to you to move that um under the front counter so everybody doesn't have to stare well, at you. Well, if I could have done this if, if I could have done this show my way, see, we wouldn't have we just flip it on and it'd be done and, and uh, we wouldn't even pay any attention to it. Oh, I see. See? Oh. Okay. This is a form of protest. Okay. <laughs> All right. My nose is running again. And your nose is running? Yeah. Do I have chocolate on my lips? No. No. Okay, You're all right. good. Good. All right. Well, let's now. get that whipped cream out. Let's see. Well, it's, get, it's getting close. It's getting there. Now, this is a double boiler. This is a double boiler. And it's a very small double boiler. I wish I could find a... If anybody in the audience knows where I can buy a big double boiler, let me know. I mean, not a great big one, but a one about Don't like they this. come in different sizes? I can't find one. They quit making... People don't cook anymore, so it's hard to buy stuff. Well, I can relate. Yeah. But, you know, really, this is, this is a, a really a great dish. And it's so easy to do. It's so quick. And it's really good. You know why it's good? Why? It's nothing but milk chocolate, heavy cream, and uh, powdered sugar. Sounds good to me. <laughs> but what about this coffee idea? I don't know about this well, coffee idea. Well, this gives idea. it a little bit of a coffee, coffee taste, you know? Hey, you're on my cords. Okay, so now, but it doesn't look very appetizing. Look at that. Now, now this takes a lot of stirring, so just now, don't quit stirring. In fact, you should have, well, no, you can stir with that. Why? Did you, do I need another utensil? No, just keep stirring. But you're not, you're not, Barbara. They... Well, I don't want it to splash on me. All right. Well, look, you do it like this now. See, so you're really stirring. Okay. Come on, Barbara. Come back here. Don't splash my apron. No. <laughs> okay. Oh, wow, wow, wow. I hate when you see those cooks and they got see, stuff this is all, all over them. <sighs> now, this is all done. And it's going to be... Uh... It's all... Cut. Let's see what it looks like. It looks like whipped cream. It's wonderful, see? But by the time the, the chocolate gets melted, it's going to be melted, too. See, that looks like whipped cream? I thought whipped cream was smooth. That's smooth. It's kind of lumpy. Barbara, you stir. You don't play with the whipped cream. I'm not. I'm stirring. Stir. I'm Keep stirring. stirring. Okay, okay, so now the, the coffee made this very dark. Yeah, well, that's good. Now, let's see. Let's put something else in. Let's put the egg yolks in. Egg this yolks. is two egg yolks. What happened to the egg whites? I fried them and ate them. Oh. <laughs> but I really did. I never did like the yolks out of eggs. I always liked the white part, so it works well. Is okay. that a cooking tip? Keep, keep stirring. Is that a cooking tip I should know about? What's that? Using egg yolks instead of egg whites or vice versa? No, it's just that it's in the recipe. Oh. The recipe says, oh, and by the way, the recipe is here. Do we even have a recipe? Yeah, I Where did you here. get this recipe? Off the box. What happened? I had the box. What box? I put the box, the box that the chocolate came in. Is it in the garbage? Baker's semi-sweet chocolate. Go look in the garbage. No, no. I put it in a box to bring it out here. No, but anyhow, it's on a box. If you buy a, bo a box of, of, of eight ounce uh, Baker's semi-sweet chocolate, you get the recipe. Okay, I'm going to ask a question. It costs $2.49 <laughs> at Hughes. Um... That Irvine Ranch market is at three dollars and a quarter. <laughs> oh, that's right. That's right. Yeah. Why couldn't we just use okay, Jello pudding? 
What do you mean jello pudding? What are you talking well, about? Well, doesn't jello pudding have a chocolate thing? Well, yeah, but it's not chocolate mousse. Chocolate mousse is like candy. It's very good. Keep stirring. Why, why do you always stop stirring? Well, I'm just, I don't know. I'm just watching, thinking maybe I'll learn something. You know, when I do this by myself, it's really quick. It doesn't take any time at all. <laughs> Funny. Because stirring is really important here. You gotta keep... I know. I take my job very seriously. Yeah, we can see that. Yeah. Very seriously. Okay, it's the okay. only job I have. Okay. All right. I don't know where I would find another job with all these perks. <laughs> and one where I didn't break any nails or anything. Okay, now so now this, this has got lumpy again. Keeps, yeah, well, it, I it, it thought, it isn't chocolate mousse supposed to be light and airy? It's light and airy. This yeah, looks it will heavy be. like lead. Well, <laughs> if you keep stirring, it will get light and airy. Light and airy. Trust me, trust me. Light and airy. Yeah, okay, let's me. bring on that whipped cream. All right, here we go. That's the only reason I showed up tonight. <laughs> <laughs> now, this is Cool Whip. Cool Whip, yeah, boring. So this, does, this doesn't... This uh, doesn't doesn't contaminate the atmosphere. Oh. It doesn't. So we're going to put it in this. Yeah, just imagine lumping that stuff on somebody. <laughs> oh. oh. Uh -oh. What a temptation. Oh. Hey, I'm stirring. Look how good I'm doing tonight. <laughs> All right. Okay, so would it, so you put it in a pa paper plastic bag. Yes, just like this. Is this another cooking tip? This is a cooking tip. Just a cooking tip. Now, what are you going to do we're with that? We're going to close this up and try to get most of the air Put out. Put it of in it. someone's seat. No. no. <laughs> this is kind of like one of those implants, I think. <laughs> All right. I wonder what happens when that leaks. And then, but we don't have anything to put this on because I'm going to cut that corner right off like that. Oh, do you think and that's then a I'm good gonna, idea? I'm going to squeeze this right out, and it comes right out just like it comes out of it. Out of it. Out of, wow. the, uh, out of the can, but we'll Can I feel it? No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, wow. <laughs> no. Kind of wild feeling. Okay. okay. Oh, here, we can do this. Here, what uh, you know, do I we just do? happen to have... What do you I have just happen to have? have some chocolate mousse here that was left over from... We did this on the on the ABC show, so this is an old. Not this for us. much fun, though. You didn't have this kind of neat gadget. No, look at look at this. Look at this now. I want you to watch this. Can the camera see this? Huh? No, it can. Can't uh oh, see? you oh. hit an air pocket. <laughs> it like farted. <laughs> oh, Barbara. It did. It went. Barbara, be nice. There now. Isn't that nice? Wow. Uh, isn't that terrific? Hey. All right. What did you use that on the home show? That was a great home show tip. They probably put it in their newsletter for two bucks. Yeah, wasn't it terrible? That little old thing, two bucks for that. I know. That. Oh, wait. No. I have to show you this. Okay. Now, how about that? Isn't that pretty? Look at that. That Isn't is that nice? very all neat. Right, all right. I have a girlfriend that takes these and puts it in her mouth and makes and ties a knot with it. Really? Yes. I'd can. like to know her. <laughs> She's very popular. <laughs> Okay, how's that doing? Now, what happened to the whipped cream? No, the whipped cream, the, the other whipped cream. Oh, here. Oh, well, now how I did it get over okay, there? Okay, I have, because people couldn't see. Oh. Um, I have a question. If we have Cool Whip and we have Ready Whip, and I'm stirring. No, oh, yeah. Let me, let me have it for a minute. Let me have it for a minute. Now, how come you had to make that? Make what? Because this is real whipped cream. That other stuff is... What? Look at this. Look at this. Something flew in here. Look at that. <gasps> oh, yeah. Ooh, and it's dying on the burner. <laughs> oh, boy. Now move that over there. We'll put this here where people can see it. Oh. Ooh, it just like crumbled up and fried. <laughs> <laughs> it's summertime. A lot of stuff flying. Now, we've got to put this in here. You've got to stir now. Okay. you got to stir, okay? Now, you got to stir quick if you don't, or this is going to cook that whipped cream. Now, I don't want uh, careful. Move your hand over, Barbara. This is hot. I don't want to burn you. Okay. All right. All right. Okay. You're doing good now. Oh, this actually looks pretty nice. Now stir. You got to keep stirring. Nice this, this, color. This this dish takes a lot of stirring. Wow. Some nights I really work for this job. 
Um, but I don't like this spoon. This is really bumming me out, this What's spoon. What's the matter? Oh, what? I'll take my other spoon back. Well, that had water all over it. Well, okay. That's okay. A little water never hurt okay. it. Okay. This is coming. This you is doing good. You got a bug on the burner. You're worried this about is, water in the really thing? This is really doing good. This is really that. doing well. Look at yeah. all those swirls. This Psychedelic. Is this is doing good. Oh, and we even have fancy dessert dishes. You bet. First cabin, I'll tell you, since we've been on ABC, he's really going all out. No, I went down I went down to Anaheim today and I bought these. You at, did? At Ace Fixture, yeah. My friend Manuel sold them to me. Well, I'll tell you, I am very impressed. Oh, that's okay. ready to go. That this is, is ready, ready to go. go? That is ready to go. Isn't that gorgeous? Okay. Isn't that re Oh, that is gorgeous. That's all great. Right. All right, all right. All right. How are you going right. to pour that in there? Well, very carefully. <laughs> <laughs> No, Barbara, no, no, Barbara. Let's don't do anything until you're told. Okay. Please put that back in the refrigerator. <laughs> okay. Okay. Okay, so you got them all done now. Okay. Now, Barbara, now. would you like to taste the Ready Whip again? <laughs> <laughs> this is the whole thing. You've got to shake it really good. Okay? All right. Then you pour it like this. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right, now. Send it to the Ready Whip. Okay. Now let me show you. Let me show you what we got here now. Okay. Let me show you through the, through the, the magic, the magic of television. Here is what you wind up with. Whoa! Isn't that nice? Isn't that nice? Isn't that nice? Now you know what we're going to do. We're going to set these all over here. Wow. Because, because this has to sit in the refrigerator for about an hour, and they get like this. It, it gets solid. Now, should you put the cherry on top in the refrigerator, or is that just before serving? Well, if you're on a TV show and you want that to come out looking nice, you put it on in the refrigerator. Oh. If you're back to the audience. Okay. All right. Can I have it screwed? No, you can't put it on now. You got This Why? has to set for an hour. And then you put it on? Then you put it on. See, because if you put it on now, it'll sink. See, it's not, it's not, it's not set. It's like... <laughs> It's like concrete. It's got to, this has got to go in the refrigerator for an hour now. Okay. Want to taste this? No, no. I know it's very, it's good stuff. I know. Okay, Barbara, you know the show is over now. We're all done. We can't do anything else. We can't do anything Just else. Just it, huh, Stanley? <laughs> Can I take this with me? <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, boy. No, I don't need to put it on the show. Boy, when I was, boy, boy, you know, you know, when I was growing up, they, they, we didn't do things like that. You really? Know. No, we. Well, were, I don't we cook were, at we, home. I gotta do something. <laughs> what? Okay. Well, hey, another we successful. We better get out of here. We're out of here. Yeah. Out of here. Okay. All right. All right. All right. But you know what? Every time I see spinach, I think about this. Because if you were on a date, okay, and your date had spinach in their teeth, would you tell them? <laughs> no, that, that's a really good question. Is that, is that isn't boiling? No, if it's not have, boiling. When you have spinach in your tooth, it looks like you lost a tooth, like the tooth's gone. No, but I mean, we've all seen that. You know, you're sitting across from somebody and they got this big honker in their teeth. Now, if you were on a date, what would be the proper etiquette? Should you just lean over and go, honey, that thing is really unattractive? Or what would you do? Gosh, I haven't been on a date so long I wouldn't, <laughs> wouldn't have any idea. Well, I think, I think women are more honest about that. It's like if, if you're at a luncheon, because, like, I live for lunch, oh. but if you're at a luncheon and the lady next to you has lipstick on their teeth, you know, you always go, that's like the universal sign. Yes. That's a universal sign. Are those your real teeth, Barbara? Honey, there's nothing real on my body. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> we got. <laughs> we... I am a miracle of modern medicine. <laughs> God. Okay. All right. We don't. Now this like is it. the hardest part of, of hush puppies. What? Getting them out of the spoon into the oil, because they I'll all want to. I'll stand wanna, back here. It's tough. They, you they, know what? You should wear my frying they, glasses. They wanna, no they kidding. Wanna, they want to drip. Ooh, boy! Look at that. Because that's hard to do. They all just like went in it. They're not in a blob. I told you it's hard to do. <laughs> I mean, 
mean, aren't they supposed to be like one tight little critter? They are, critter? yes, they are. Well, and I got news for you, buddy, they're not. When you, and I told you this was the hardest part of it, but this does work because huh. I did it. Barbara, we've got problems here. Oh my God, let's throw it out and start over again. We did something wrong. <laughs> what has happened? I don't know. Damn, that looked like toxic waste. Did we forget? <laughs> did, we, did we forget something? You know what? Let's go back to the recipe. I bet we forgot something. Well, oh, you know, boy. it's this hillbilly stuff. No wonder nobody no, we bakes had, this stuff. We had the eggs. Cornmeal, baking pan. Maybe you put too much of that puffy stuff in. Well, you know, we probably had too much milk. Think so? Okay. You know what, then? Let's add more cornmeal. Boy. <laughs> Can't believe he's actually asking me. I'm the one that found the teeth. Barbara, um, talk about your stuff there. Okay, cornmeal. The Let's people. make it globular. This is awful. This is the worst thing we've ever done. <laughs> Boy. Okay. This is, this is worse than the, the... Remember the onion rings? I know. <laughs> This is worse than the onion rings. Look at that. Okay, throw, throw them away and let's start again. All right, all right. Throw we, them away. All right, but I, I got to get, get to the sink here. You've got oh. all this stuff. Okay. Um, I get faxes and letters from all kinds of things. So this is kind of a public service fax I got. And this is very, very um, timely because it's in the news. It says, woman chops off sleeping husband's weenie and drops it for moving car. <laughs> it says, don't laugh, it's true. It could happen to you. Right now, thousands of agitated, irate women have read this headline and are contemplating similar action against you the next time you make an unwanted advance, look at them the wrong way, or just generally wow. piss them off. <laughs> it says, men, protect yourself now. If you found yourself a victim of CDS, which is called Chop and Drop Syndrome. <laughs> oh, Barbara. Could you be sure that the part they found was yours? <laughs> it says, inquire now about our low-cost weedy protection plan. And there are two basic packages. Package A says they will register your weenie and tattoo it with a registration number ensuring that in case of separation you get the same part back. And then there are the balls of steel, which is plan C. And it says we offer a one-size-fits-all battery-operated stainless steel jock strap that can be worn when necessary. When you're asleep, an alarm will be activated when metal or other Bar dangerous objects come within a foot of you. Oh, boy. It says, don't get short, caught short. Order now, 1-800-SAVE-A-WEE-WEE. Boy. I actually got this today, so in I thought it kind of... Are you going to put flour in that? Boy, what are we doing?